Good morning. Welcome to the forecast discussion for Tuesday, November 3rd, 2015. We have a mild morning. It's going to get even more mild as we head towards the rest of this week. How about 70s for highs in some locations? Almost like it's early to mid-September rather than early November. Well, currently we have temperatures in the upper 30s to lower 40s over the northern interior, mid to upper 40s in the suburbs, and lower to mid 50s in the urban areas and along the immediate coast. We have winds that are light and variable with high pressure in complete control. As you can see, high pressure is sitting right over the northern Atlantic and will remain in that spot for the next 24 hours and then shift off the coast, producing a southwesterly wind by tomorrow afternoon and very mild weather conditions. So with that high pressure in control, you have clear skies from the mid-Atlantic coast all the way back to the central plains, even the eastern Rockies, and those tranquil conditions are going to continue on through Thursday before we have a cold front move through on Friday afternoon and evening with some scattered showers. Taking a look at the latest forecast again for today, high pressure and control, high temperatures in the upper 60s to lower 70s. For this evening, scattered cloud cover, light and variable winds, temperatures falling through the 60s and 50s. Overnight tonight, sky cloud cover expected, and by tomorrow morning, with clear sky to sky cloud cover, look for lows in the mid to upper 40s over the interior, lower to mid 50s in the suburbs, and mid to upper 50s in some of your urban areas. For tomorrow afternoon, high pressure will be off the coast with a southwesterly wind. Look for temperatures to rise into the upper 60s to lower 70s. And on Thursday, with high pressure in place, look for sky cloud cover with lows in the mid to upper 40s over the interior, lower to mid 50s along the coast, high temperatures in the mid to upper 60s. Now on Friday, a cold front will approach the region. Most of the day on Friday will be dry. By the time we get to the evening hours, look for a few scattered showers with temperatures ranging from the mid to upper 50s for lows and upper 60s to lower 70s along the coast, lower to mid 70s in some of the urban areas, especially in the Delaware River Valley very warm day on the way for Friday. That cold front will push off the coast by Saturday morning with a few lingering showers, clearing skies by the afternoon though, so this weekend doesn't look all that bad. Low temperatures on Saturday in the mid to upper 50s, high temperatures only in the upper 50s to lower 60s as that polar air builds in. On Sunday with high pressure and control, look for lows in the mid to upper 30s over the interior, lower to mid 40s along the coast, high temperatures in the lower to mid 50s, which is where we should be for this time of year. And on Monday, high pressure and complete control with clear skies, lows in the lower to mid 30s over the interior, upper 30s to lower 40s along the coast, high temperatures in the mid to upper 50s. And finally on Tuesday, with high pressure shifting off the coast, look for a southwesterly wind to develop, lows in the mid to upper 30s over the interior, lower to mid 40s along the coast, high temperatures in the mid to upper 50s. That is your forecast discussion for today. Of course, it is November 3rd, so get out there and vote. We have a lot of local elections to uh, definitely have handled. So be sure to get out there and vote. And as always, stay safe out there.